Hi everybody, I'm Lorenzo from lorenzocapicard.com and today I want to show you how to use the Jingle Deformer in a Cinema 4D. First of all, let's go to the Demograph menu and let's create a new text. <coughs> if you like, we can change font. Ok now, increase depth for example 150 Then let's go to the caps tab, select start for example fillet cap and end fillet cap again Now select type for example quadrangles And check on regular grid then select width for example 5 so then let's go to the object tab and set intermediate point for example uniform set number by 8 ok then select subdivision for example 15 Ok now select more text and make editable then right click and select children and make editable again right click again and select children and right click again and connect object and delete Ok now select more text and and let's go to the deformer tab and let's create a new jingle select jingle and drag and drop into the motex object then select jingle let's go to the object tab and set up steepness for example 45% and structural for example 45 then Select Modex again and let's go to the Simulate menu, Particles and let's create a new Turbulence Ok now, set Strength for example 350 and Scale by 35% Then let's go to the Fellow tab and set Shape for example Box and set sides for example 150, 150 and 75 ok now if you like we can increase the value of sides for example 10% ok now select Jingle and let's go to the then let's go to the forces tab and drag and drop the turbulence particles into the forces field. Okay, now would you like we can change the timeline seconds, for example, twenty seconds. Ok, now we can animate the scene and set 0 seconds at microframe Then set 10 seconds and Add microframe again 15 seconds Drag the file of box and add microframe and finally 20 seconds and drag the fill of box and
should add a new keyframe. Okay, now let's create a new camera. And set 10 seconds. Add new frame. Add again 20 seconds and add a new frame. Okay, now double click and let's create a new material. Uncheck color, uncheck reflection, and check on luminance. Then select texture, for example, gradient, type, for example, 2D circular. Okay, now let's create a new plane. and add a new material. Then let's create the floor. Double click and let's create a new material again. and select color, for example, gradient and like blue <coughs> and black. Then select type, for example, to this circular again.
select texture and select projection for example OVWE mapping okay now select shader and denier set color like like blue and illumination for example 65 75% Then set specular like one percent. Okay, now we can add the material on the scene. And now let's create a new light, for example, area light. Set shadow, for example, shadow map soft. <clears throat> okay, now let's go to the render settings. Set up to, for example, film beyond and HDTV <clears throat> then let's go to effect tab and add ambient occlusion set minimum samples for example 150 and accuracy for example 100% uh, then let's go to effect tab again and let's create a global illumination set gamma for example 1.5 and would you like we can add on scene the hybrid norms <clears throat> 